good thing. Good thing I thought of it. I know. It's a good thing you watched it. I know. Okay. Hey guys, today we are here with a very special client. All of our clients are, are very special, but this one is really special because it's not your, your every day. And uh, if she can do this, you can do this. So we're going to tell you again at the end of this, stop the car, pull the, the door open, make the call, do what you got to do. Okay. So tonight, today, Mallory is with us and what an inspiration she is. And I'm very excited for her to start sharing her a little bit of the story with you. So, Mallory, how long have you been a client here? You, was Since February. February of uh, 19. Mm -hmm. February 19. Now, you're not 19, but you know. Yeah. Okay, so what made you decide to join I and be part of IF Nation? Sure. Um, so, I have a progressive neuromuscular disease that's hereditary in my family, and the past couple of years I've seen quite a bit of progression in the disease. And for my health, um, it's always better. The less weight I have on my legs, the better for me. And I've driven by this place many times, cutting through the parking lot on my way to work, and always thought about stopping in, but was a little scared for quite a while about if this was something that could work for me, so. Yeah, yeah. So basically, what you're not seeing, because we took a take already, so my head was cut off, so if I'm going like this, I'm kind of, <laughs> Shy. No, but what it means it is like the hands and, and the yeah, face. Yeah, so it's my in, legs and yeah. my hands. Yeah, my legs from my knees down and my hands from my wrists to my fingertips. Yeah, so yeah. it makes just extra, well, life as we know it, extra hard, you know, so. Mm -hmm. um, and you heard that she, it took her a while to come in because she drove by our, our studio here in Manchester for some time. Now, yes. she saw it and it took us six months to open this studio, so. She was going to work probably every day for during those six months. So this was a well thought out, but also overcoming some fears. Yes. Yeah. So, what was your biggest surprise of yourself since joining and being part of this? My biggest team? surprise of myself was is my motivation and my determination. I've, I've done many diets in the past where I've stuck with it for a month or a couple months and then given up on myself. Um, and coming in through these doors and um, and having the conversations, you know, they really were able to adapt to my limitations, and um, I was very surprised that I stuck with it and made this a lifestyle change. Yes, because what we work with you, what is, we don't believe in the diets. We're just taking going from unhealthy to healthier to just be a healthy lifestyle and. We did it just in stages and right. right around. And let me tell you, she's had from celebrations to not so pleasant, tearful occasions. And I'm just gonna bring up this last two nights ago. Mm -hmm. Your your good celebration. Yes. And what did you find out? What did you become aware of about that? I became aware that at a recent celebration where I Seven treated myself. Marriage with her and her husband. Yes, thank so, you. Yes. So we went out to dinner and I treated myself with, you know, an appetizer, a nice heavy pasta dish, mm -hmm. and dessert. As that, well she should have. Yeah. Because um, once a year. Right, once a year. Mm -hmm. That I felt really awful. Um, physically, I guess, and mentally afterwards. Later that night. Later that night and the next day as yeah. well. Um, and I came in and I talked to Jim about it and I, picked myself right back up and I started right back on my nutrition plan the following day. Mm -hmm. um, but I used to eat that way quite often, yeah. so I was really, it was eye-opening to me how different my body feels now, yeah. eating those foods that I used to eat so yeah. often. Yeah, and that's great, I mean, to be aware, to know that you can do that and it, that it's not gonna derail you because again, it's not a diet, it's not a quick fix, but it's not about limiting, it's just about you know, enjoying that night for that night rather right. than, you know, making it deep your feelings. Yes. You know, good, bad, sad, whatever. So the other thing here, now, and, and, and the next question is, um, I'll just say, to someone else out there right now on the fence, what would you say to them um, as far as joining if they're fearful or anything like that? 
I would say don't be afraid to just come in and ask the questions because there's always a way to do the exercises if you have limitations, um, things that need to be adjusted to suit you. Jim will find a way to make it happen for you. Oh yes. Just don't be afraid and take that step and walk in the door. Hence the name Individual Fitness. I mean, you're not seeing this, but she does have the cane. I like to steal the cane often. Uh, one thing, did we talk about your results, the results you've gotten here in yeah. such a little... Have we? I don't think so. I don't think we did. That was on the end of the tape. So, so let us, tell us, yeah. tell us what have you accomplished so far, other than sitting on a Swiss ball that you yeah. want to talk. What? So I've lost almost 20 pounds so far and two pant sizes. Um, and I feel great. I'm walking a lot easier. I haven't had any falls. I've had one fall since I started. Yep. That was but, my, um, my fault. I, 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 yeah, I said, hey, let's, let's progress. You sure? Yeah. I wasn't thinking. But you didn't get hurt. Yeah. She's yeah. <laughs> smiling right now. So, yeah, yeah. It was a safe fall. Let's yes, just it say was very that. safe. Yes. Almost like a, it was a very made safe. for TV. Right. Yeah. yeah. So, well, anyway, oh my god, I almost forgot to tell you like, your amazing results. So, yeah. I mean, let's just say, you've already said uh, on the fence, but hey, you have no excuse out there. She came, overcame her fears, was just probably like you are now, months and months of thinking, thinking, and, and, and just made the call, really. Mm -hmm. And uh, we just sat and talked, and, and we found that way. Yep. And, uh, what an inspiration you are. Thank you Thank for you. Being Thank so, you very much. Yes. And we look forward to hear more pounds on the ground and yes. uh, sizes smaller. All right? Thank you. You're welcome. There you go. Okay, that's probably, that's probably better. We have to do it again, Jim. I, I, don't, I don't think so.